a friend of mine that owns a tree cutting business here in town brought me a load of wood chips as you see behind me that'll be coming up in an episode uh, probably in a week or so moving those okay here's what we're doing today it's Tuesday uh, sun is really shining beautiful day uh, I don't even see any clouds in the sky and it's about 70 to 72 degrees and I've got some mowing to do uh, a couple times I've had somebody mention you know how was the fuel economy on my Ferris mower with the fuel injected engine so I just now filled it up and we're gonna mow today and I'm gonna run this thing for a little while and then I'm gonna come back and fill it up same pump same way on the trailer the whole deal we'll kind of get an idea about how much fuel I use also I've got the 20 volt 60 volt flex volt battery and um, I'm going to be using that with the uh, 20 volt weed eater that one out that was a small duplex as you saw and um, not much long to that Well, I just knocked this lot out. Uh, it's this house, and then behind it has the large lot. I tell you what, it don't take this this mower long to knock out a lot this size right here. It can mow this in a hurry. I am really tickled with this stand-on mower and uh, the ability of it, how quick it mows, and uh, you know it striped this lawn up pretty good for just being an old, what I call a weed lawn.
the 20 volt 60 volt flex volt battery uh, really got some good power in this weed eater uh, it, it spun it really good I could tell um, seemed like it might have had just a little more RPMs to it and um, the battery on it uh, last I had two batteries with me and when I got through today I still had plenty of power plenty of battery life left uh, I didn't drain either one of the battery Well, that's a wrap for today. Just wash the mower off. Okay, this is shot Wednesday. <clears throat> the reason I'm grouping all these together is I'm gonna go fill that lawnmower up. Uh, I've got a mow two in Auburn. And so after I mow them, I'm going to go fill the mower up. Just kind of see how much fuel it burned. All right, here's where I'm at. Uh, I don't even know what time it is. It's after 12, I imagine. Uh, I've been on the run all morning. If you haven't, it's 12 o'clock. Is um, I had to get up on the roof. I had a house that the uh, roof's not real old, but I had some nails working their way, way out, and the shingles were sticking up. So I had to get up there and uh, nail them, you know, put them back down, and put some tire under the shingles to stick them back down. Then I had to go over to another house and do something. So it's just been run, run, run. And I say all that to say uh, I'm running up here to Auburn now to mow a couple yards. And when I put the, got the mower out of the garage and was loading it on the trailer, I was just like, I needed this. I enjoy mowing. That's one of the reasons I do it, is I just really like it and it's a good stress reliever and uh, you know that, that mowing just is a good stress reliever a relaxer and uh, so i'm running up here to do that and then i'm going to fill it up with fuel and we'll see how many gallons that it takes okay i just filled uh, the ferris up with gas and it held three gallons so i mowed 11 lawns and they were small to medium lawns small to average and one that was a large one you know that's got the house in the big lot so it has an eight gallon tank so 
uh, and I've three gallons has filled it to the rim so that was all it would hold so that means I had five more gallons of gas uh, yesterday I mowed say starting about 1230 and I mowed to 530 and there was little to no you know just very little downtime in between yards because they're all just really close together so there's very little traveling time and so you know I, to me that's pretty good use three gallons of gas the grass was you know fairly tall and in some of the lawns this time of year it gets really tough it's dried out it's a lot of crab grass and just really tough so and my blades weren't sharpened uh so all in all factoring in all of that i think it was pretty good uh i know back you know when i first got it um uh, just kind of sort of keeping up with it I, I would mow all day long and you know and had plenty of gas left at the end of the day so to me um it seems to be pretty efficient with the fuel so anyway uh, i'm going to get me a haircut right now so you just sit tight today's about over Gosh, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Get out of here. Haircut time. I want to do about the same thing. That light is good right there. About the same thing, the way you cut it a little short here, letting this grow out, it might need just a little straightening up. Then this, you know, take a little off up here, not a whole lot on that. Just kind of straighten it up a little. Right there. All right. All right, Captain. 